fact of the week. Bill, you often talk about conspiracies. Yes, I do. Um, this may or may not fall into that category, but it definitely pisses me off. I love this guy already. I don't know if this is a conspiracy, but it fucking pisses me off. Eyeball to eyeball with you so far, buddy. All right. I get my cable and internet service bundled together from Time Warner. Last month with my bill, I got an, ins- uh, an insert stating that they were modifying their privacy policy. Basically, it states Time Warner reserves the right to distribute my internet content with or without my consent. From my understanding, this could mean anything from the searches I requested from Google to the websites I have been to. What rights do we have in this country anymore? Just venting. All right, dude. Yeah, absolutely. Basically, what they've been doing the entire fucking time since the beginning of the internet is now becoming legal. So for all you people out there who always thought like, uh, like I love when you watch like those, those talk shows and they talk about um, sexting, like your you're, you're text messaging, you know, I want to fuck you from behind, whatever. Why that's sexy, I have no idea. You know, do you think their thumbs tremble? But whatever, I'm not going to judge. Or like they, they talk about Skype sex and they'll be like, why do these people do this? Why would somebody who would never, and they always bring a psychologist on, Right? And they always have a beard so you know that they majored in psychology, right? And <laughs> then they go, they always say the same shit. And they'll be just like, well, it's the uh, anonymity of it. They, they, they feel anonymous. And, and in that situation, they, 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 they do things that they normally wouldn't done. Well, first of all, people, it's not anonymous, you dumb fucks. It isn't. They're just saying it's anonymous. They just said it. Well, you don't think that they're building a file on you? It's all these fucking morons who've lived the life of the straight and narrow, get on Skype, and they stick their junk right in the camera. You're an idiot. You're done. You're already done because they, they, they're building robots right now to, re, to fucking replace all of us. And what did you... And, but they're going to keep some of us because somebody's got to oil their fucking robot joints. And what did you do? You stuck your dick in the camera. You, you processed. It's over. It's over. You got to take the driver's test. I wouldn't even, I wouldn't even study. You're fucking finished. You're going to get processed just like those people in that fucking movie with that guy who just died. I can never remember the name. What's the name of the, Patrick Swayze was in it. Blood Force Thunder. New America. What the fuck was it called? Here come the Russians. Pissing the radiator. All that, all that hatred's going to, going to, going to eat you up. Keeps me warm. Remember that? Ed Bagley Jr. was in it? No, he wasn't. The fucking, uh, the kid who was in Soul Man was in it. And he shot his friend. Avenge me. Come on. Red Dawn. Jesus Christ, Brian, you're a fucking director. Do you get that, man? When, when you get like you had that panic, that brain panic? Yeah, I just got it. Okay, you just got it? Okay, good. I thought it was only me. Uh, yeah, absolutely. Uh, know this, people. If you want to watch porn, like porn, the porn industry is fucking, is going through what the music industry is going through right now where all of a sudden the shit just became free, all right? So now everybody's fucking whacking off on the internet thinking nobody's watching what you're fucking rubbing your shit out to. They're all watching, and they're building a fucking file, all right? You think already, haven't you noticed why the presidents keep getting worse and worse, and they keep fucking getting on their knees and blowing the banks more and more? It's because of the internet. All they got to do is break out their internet file, and show them some of the shit that they know that they jerked off to. And it's, it's over. It's fucking over. You got to do everything that they're going to say. Or they're going to expose you. They don't even need to take you to Dallas anymore. That's old school. That's why Kennedy got shot in the head. If there was an internet, he'd still be walking around talking right now. Cutting the ribbon at his fucking library. Shit in his pants. He would have gave the eulogy at Fathead Ted's fucking funeral. Um... Yeah, so that's that's what I'm saying. Okay, if you want to if you want to jerk off to something freaky, I would say go to a porn store and just deal with the fact that the guy behind the counter is going to know what you got. Pay cash and walk away. It's a done deal. But if you're going to go on the internet <laughs> and do some of the shit that you're doing, all you can hope now is that you're going to get lost in the shuffle. Actually, you can continue to do what you're doing as long as you never try to affect, if you never try to effectively effect change. You know what I mean? That's, that's when they break out your internet file. Other than that, it just goes on a fucking database. But the second you start a movement going, you know what, dude? 
I'm sick of paying 25 bucks for my first bag when I get on a plane. If you get enough people behind you, United will now go to Time Warner and be like, yeah, Russell Johnson. Yeah, open his file. What is he jerk? What's the most fucked up thing he's jerked off to? <laughs> that is the end of the movement. Because then Fox News will get it. And they'll just be like, it turns out Russell Johnson jerked off to a tranny and a midget last week. This is the guy who's going to lead us? I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm doing Glenn Beck. I mean, I, I, I don't, I don't, I don't. That fucking guy. Jesus Christ. I respect those guys because they're in show business. I just wish, maybe, maybe they can't admit that they're in show business. It's like wrestling. For the longest time, they couldn't say that it was fake. But now, you know, at some point, come on, just say, look, we're doing fake news. We know, we know who's going to win in the end of this shit. Oh, no, it's all horrible. All right, well, how much time are we up to here? 